Arthur. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah. Of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. Wait for me. get off that mountain then this Micah's got a crazy side off it what were you boys doing you're supposed to be scouting ahead for us I kept asking him what we was doing but he was you worry too much kid just just some business to attend to kid you know how he is yes I do he was half soaked before we even got there then we ran into some fellas one of them Micah knew drank some more and this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about market. It was drank that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? What are you doing? <laughs> Big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. Here we are.
Just one or two. Right off them? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. You'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Micah... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, there, Dullards! My lord, you men is dull. <laughs> and leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People have been leaving me alone for the last ten years. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. But me and the kid here, well, we're trying to talk business. So could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. <laughs> oh. Mm. oh. <laughs> That's great, partner. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? My friend, you know where we went? No idea. Hey, you see my friend anywhere? Don't ask me. You see that fella I was with? Can't help you there. You know which way my friend went? your mouth, mister.
Cheers. Not you again. You moron. Not again. Thomas Downs! Downs! Whatever do you want? Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Really? Threaten me, would you? Uh, please, I have a family, sir, please. I don't care about your family. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir. I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts. I'm I'm not running anywhere. I'm I'm I'm, do, I'm doing my best for you. Be reasonable. <laughs> You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money.
Easy now. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. What's wrong? Thought you'd be happy to be off that mountain. Oh, I don't know. You ain't been yourself for a while. All right, well, I should be getting on. All right. Ah! Help! Please! Uh, anyone! Oh. <laughs> hey, what's oh, with the holler? Please help me! Oh. Oh. I got bit. Oh, God. Oh, oh, I need medicine or a siphon. Oh, oh, oh. All right, all right. Oh. Quit moaning. Christ. Oh, oh God. Let's keep this between us. Oh, you saved my life. I owe you. Not that right. I do. Oh. Oh. Now I, I gotta get out of here. No, oh. oh. God, oh. don't much like it around here no more. Glad I could help. Keep your eyes on the ground, huh? Come on, Mr. Morgan. I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither, but see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or deal with business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They're children of God. How's about you playing his place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down, then. I'm in, sir. This is Marvin. What's your free book? Be about this. Same goes for you. So... Now you two know each other anyway. Don't seem like a lot of friends. You don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone. I guess it's something like that. Can we play? He can't be no real fortune. He committed all five cardinal sins just in that year you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. And life is a challenge. Well, all of us. Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey. And I don't remember much after that. <laughs> Call. He's a decent fellow going through a bad time. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad time, too. All right, all right. Just try to have a little fun here. It is a game after all, mister. Yeah, I know. Pretty pathetic. Oh, come on. This ain't kid poker. There we go. Well, look at you. There. The same what you call finishing strong. Big pile of nothing. Ah, ah, ah. Damn. Yeah. Come on. Mm. <laughs> Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Well, sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. 
Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where it? <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Off him. I didn't say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch. What the hell is your problem? He's with me. <laughs> Having fun yet? <laughs> I'll kill you both. <laughs> Tell anyone what you saw back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell us so. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. It's the last thing I needed. <sighs> now what? Where's Reverend? Simple mistake. You can still be saved. What have you done with your foot? It appears to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here. Twist your leg, you drunken bastard. Get it. Come on. Thank you, sir. Uh, uh, oh, no, you don't. What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that. There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard. Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... <sighs> Okay, girl. Uh, okay, 
girl. when he'd show up. You'll work it out, Dutch. You always do. Thank you, Arthur. I should have known. Get that fool back to his tent to sleep it off. <laughs> you better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. <laughs> what happened? Just the usual. Poor <laughs> bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. 